Here's everything you need to know about charging the Pixel 7 Pro. The Pixel 7 Pro has a 5,000 milliamp hour battery. And to take full advantage of the 24 watt max charging speed of the Pixel 7 Pro or 23 watts of the Pixel 7, you are going to need a USB-C power delivery PPS charger. The PPS just stands for Programmable Power Supply. It's the same quick charging standard that most new laptops and all Samsung's phones uses. Now, the Pixel 7 Pro will charge it over 24 watts. The Pixel 7 will charge at 23 watts. I would suggest that you just get a 30 watt USB-C power delivery PPS charger and I linked to one that I reviewed right up here. If you wanna use wireless charging on the other hand, you are going to need a 15 watt Qi EPP or extended power profile Qi wireless charger and that will allow you to charge the Pixel 7 Pro at 15 watts or the Pixel 7 at 15 watts. This is the same charging standard as Samsung uses for their super fast wireless charging. And if you're looking to get a great wireless charger, the Samsung 15 watt Qi wireless chargers have built in fans and I think they're a pretty good deal. But if you want to buy the Google Pixel stand, that's going to allow for 23 watt fast charging. It's likely that Google doesn't unlock this faster wireless charging because in order to charge at such a high rate, you need to be using a fan to cool the device and prevent thermal throttling. Even though the, even though the Pixel stand has fans built in, just like all the Samsung uh, Qi wireless chargers, you still don't get that full max 23 watt wireless charging because Google is Google and they want you to use their products so they know that your device isn't getting cooked alive. If you're looking for my personal suggestions, I'd highly suggest that you pick up one of the Samsung 15 watt Qi wireless chargers or get this charging brick that I reviewed for less than $20. It's got a review right up here and you're gonna to wanna to get some high quality USB-C power delivery compatible cables and I'll have a link to more of those videos for cables linked right here. Peace. Here's if you guys just want to get a much better chart, one side we have people complaining that the Pixel 7 series needs to charge faster, and on the other side there's users like me that just kind of don't care.